We have rivers, we have lakes, we have ponds. They might not be the ones of legend or of story, but maybe they should be. The idea that you only go and fish in, in an exotic place and don't really give a crap about where you live is a bad dynamic for all of us. The tidal Potomac River running through DC is just, that's our river, that's our home. When I tell people I'm gonna go fish in the Potomac, I generally hear that reaction, you're kidding, they're, you're, they're fishing the Potomac? They'd be like, oh, Potomac, uh, you don't need anything out there, or you don't keep anything, do you? Or uh, there's fish in there? It's like, yeah, there's a lot of fish in the Potomac. In fact, it's full of fish. I would say fishing on the Potomac reaches fever pitch in April when the shatter ends. Went and caught 60, went and caught 70. There's another one right there. It just never gets old, it never gets old. See, the Potomac is not the next best thing, but the best thing. It's really about fishing where you are. God, he freaking crushed that thing. Well, the Potomac, if you fish it, all the issues are there. You can talk about pollution, there's tidal fish, there's urban sprawl, there's overfishing, there's invasive species. 2004, the first snakehead was caught in this open tidal system in a Virginia waterway. They're just, they're so elusive, it's a total challenge. It's a steelhead or Fish of thousand cats. It's like the fish of a hundred thousand cats. If on one hand we talk about conserving natural resources and keeping them healthy for recreational use, and on the same breath sort of say, I'd like to have the river all to myself, we're sort of kidding ourselves. You can't kind of have both. A lot of times in fly fishing it's been kind of like, you know, this is my secret. I don't really want to share it with you. I'd like you to do it, but I don't really want to tell you how. Clearly that hasn't really worked out for us. We have to create interest in the resource itself. We have to, in many times, in many cases, teach people how to use it. We want to expand the pool of people who care about the place. And we're seeming to have some success. You can connect with that environment, with that world, with the natural order of things, just by going fishing in the city, and I think that that's awesome. I think that it's such a contrast, and I think it's an awesome one.